Hi everyone. Today we're going to be talking about your search results within the Go Open Michigan webpage and what they actually mean. So if you're going through a search, and I'm going to do an example one, we'll do point of view, and I'll just pick the subject area, and then I'm just going to click search. It's going to bring up all the resources that fall within those criteria that I just put in. In this case, I have 35. Now, each resource is found in a white rectangle, um, and it usually comes with a picture and then the title. And the title is also the link to the actual resource. So I can click on that, and that will bring me right to the resource. Now, if I find that I really like this resource and I want to find more, possibly by the same people that created it, I can come down here and notice there is this provider area, and next to it it says Michigan Virtual, so that they're the ones that created this one. So if I click on it, it's going to change my search, and it's just going to look for things created by Michigan Virtual. And you'll notice right here it says Selected Filters, Michigan Virtual, and then there are 651 different resources. And so I can work through it that way. If I go back... I'll also, you'll also notice that you have um, material types. So if you just want interactive um, resources, you can click on that and that will bring up all the interactive ones. Or maybe you want to search by specific subject. Um, so this one's composition and rhetoric. And so I can do that. All right. So I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on figuring out what your search results mean within the Go Open Michigan webpage.